Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of YouTube, welcome to Enriched Entertainment. Today we are going to start a series on Cuphead. And uh, I've played it before. I've got about 80% of the way through it, but something either I've, uh, my data gets corrupted or something happens to where I lose it. So we're going to start it all today and we're going to see if we can actually get through it this time. Here's part one, most of Inkwell Isle. Enjoy. All right, guys, today we're going to play some Cuphead, so. I love this game. All right, so as you can see, I've played it before. I've gotten that way through, and that's about as far as I've gotten. Once upon a time in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there lived, were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog, exclaimed King Dice, the casino's sleazy manager. These fellas can't lose. Nice run, boys, laughed a newcomer. The brothers gasped. It was the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now, how about we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. One more, one more roll, and all the loot in my casino is yours, the devil boomed. But if you lose, I'll have your souls. Deal? Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their very lives. The, there must be another way, way to repay you, Mugman stammered. Yes, p -p please, Mr. Cuphead added. Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil snickered pulling out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me, and I just might pardon you two mugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You will have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls. Otherwise, I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panted Cuphead. We have to find the Elder Kettle. He'll know what to do. There we go. What a fine pickle you boys have gotten it yourselves into. I don't know. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fates. You must play along for now collecting those contracts. And you'd best be ready for some nasty business. Your dead or friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into terrible beasts. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. It will give you the most remarkable magic abilities. Now go to my writing desk and use the mystical inkwell there. You need to prepare yourselves for a scrap. He was that guy everybody piled on. I've been playing, uh... I gotta get used to the game again. I've been playing Elden Ring. So I'm used to be for dashing and rolling and all that.
Okay, so B is the super move, A is jump again. All right, I think I remember how to play. I guess we'll find out. Hey, fellas, looks like you're in for it now, eh? Well, I used to be the same way, always getting into trouble, running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer just strolling around and going to the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand. Take this. Three coins. So now we have four, and I'm going to go ahead and hit the shop early. Which one? I'm going to go ahead and get the smug bomb. It'll help me get through the first level. Okay. Nope. I have a pretty good idea of what order I'm going to do the first several things in. Because, like, the first half of what I'm about to do, pretty much what I'm going to do this whole episode is not... is what the easier parts are to me. You don't really have trouble with this level or a couple oh, of the bosses. Of course, I say that right when I fall. But oh, and if I actually pay attention to what I'm doing, that generally tends to help. trying to go too fast not wanting to slow down there we go there we go I'm doing a little better this time Sir, come on. Yes. I'll take a B. get the heart or the spread now I get the roundabout goodbye
I'm gonna go ahead and put that first. And here we go. There we go. Hello. Don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, bye bye. Oh, you little bastard. I didn't think he was going to come out that for freaking close to me you're like right next to me literally okay I was about to dash too Just in time. Do your thing. All right. I thought it was gonna make it quick. In case y'all hadn't noticed, I suck that up. I suck at pretty much all games, but I enjoy them. So it works. I'm just gonna kill him this time. Dang it. Die already, dude. There we go. Sweet. A plus. So I'll be an A plus on all of them. But these are the two easy ones. And I still get hit. the wrong way and I just walked into him
I thought I was getting away from him and I almost had him. Of course I almost had him. What? I'm not... I know he's like a giant version of the smaller blobs in that first run and gun level but I don't know what those are supposed to be everything else is kind of, I feel like I'm, everything else is pretty well defined as to what it is and this is like not so much And then I have one more left. This is the last of what's quote unquote easy. Everything else still takes me a couple of tries, even the last time I tried. Go jump go No, no crap so much later on mm. why can't I get this now I'm just gonna get the There we go. Oh, all right. I hate these little wasp thingies. There's. I hate it all, really. Oh. And this is I've doing I've died now on all four of the things 
that I consider easy, so you know that's always fun. I wasn't trying to do that, but all right. Let's do this. There we go. Not real thrilled about having already lost a life there, but all right. the other one too why not that ain't gonna go well I'll just Go ahead and restart it now. There we go. Oop. Decent shape here. There we go. Dang it. I anticipated it and jumped anyway when I didn't need to. And then I got hit by it. So that sounds about right. Oh, I almost jumped, walked right off the edge. Right. I might already get go ahead and get irritated on the quote-unquote easy I shouldn't have said that I screwed myself by saying that Oh crap. 
I'm just gonna go. Screw those bugs. Whew. And then I get hit anyway. Dang it. There we go. of a match of it once like those things just don't stop through this first part of it what I get for standing that close. First time I've ever done that. I did not like landing that close to him. That's one way to get that, I guess. There we go. There we go. There we go. seemed rather quick I felt like I should have had to hit him more times there and I have had to in the past all right I'll take it Liam and get our first super this one's not too bad they move pretty slow and they don't usually send two at a time at you they sent two off too close together fast and the, the 
gonna say, I figured he was the last one. Gosh, I don't know how to thank you boys for saving me. Where are my manners? I didn't even introduce myself. I am known as the legendary Chellis. Pleased to meet you. I was searching for magic and got trapped by the ghosts. Speaking of magic, please accept this gift. It should help. There are other mausoleums around Inkwell Isle. I just wonder. A new super. Dear me, you mustn't forget that magical super arts have to be equipped in the menu before use. Okay. So I hear you fellows have some sort of gave some of them ghosts what for. Glad someone finally sorted them out. Might make the fishing even better here. Then again, might not. All right, so fish, fishing. All right. Let's see, which do I want to go to next? All right, I think I'm gonna go ahead and, and we're gonna do him next. All right, and here we go again. Well, see this one really will hit him every time I'm up here. Oh, hey, nope. Sorry, not today. Dang it! That's what happens to me every time. I'm so worried about avoiding and trying to get that guy at the top that flies back and forth. But I am not paying attention to other stuff and I end up getting hit by other things. And trying to jump right there. I didn't do it on purpose. And just like that, I'm dead. That's great. Yeah, I'm just gonna use this one. Alrighty. Well. I was about to say, is one of those gonna kill this little green guy? Nope. Nope. Come at me. Okay. 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 Oh, duh. no, see, and that's why I try to, that's why I worry so much about that one guy. It's because he he's up there and you can't jump. I jumped, but all right. That's kidding me. Okay, jump down here. Okay. No, uh, die already. There we go.
Whoa. Yeah. I'm okay. There we go. See, this little, this flying thing is gonna, there we go. All right. There we go. kind of great I got now, I'm not worrying about grades through any of this I'm just trying to beat it and then once I actually beat the game this time then I'll come worry about it see that one purple guy the first one whoa I feel like this is going a lot faster than it normally does about as well as it normally does I do have generally a problem getting past her. Every time, I've, every time I've played her, it takes me a while, so. Hopefully. Whoa. Dang it. start dashing more whenever uh, or shrinking more during that phase whenever she does that because whenever I do it actually works there we go. Uh, I hate this one no oh. Like the only time of that's ever happened <laughs> that I've ever gotten through that unscathed. I've tried to kind of figure out and memorize where these UFOs do their thing and I don't 
Um, no, really, but so far so good. Die, die. There we go. I usually have a problem with her. Maybe you guys are my good luck charm. Did they actually got a bee? Not bad. All right. And. I think, yep, that only leaves one person left. One thing left to do here. And let's go down here and deal with these guys. But we're gonna save that till next time and. We're going to, before we go, get the extra heart. And then. I want to get the spread because that's helpful on those guys, Ruby and Croaks. Okay. Now I want to keep the roundabout as my shot. But I want to make that my shot A and B. That my shot B. So, and then actually, I'm going to change my charm. Because I feel like it's kind of hard to keep track. Once you get down here to the moving platforms at the end, it's kind of hard to keep track. So, anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks. Bye. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, stick around for part two. If you liked the video, then hit like, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you later. Bye.